This is a little video to show you how uh, the wonderful Logically tool works. Now, Logically is a serious tool for serious circuit design. We're just going to use it in school to learn about basic logic circuits and get a little understanding of Boolean algebra. So, make sure you type in the proper address in the address bar here, including the slash demo. If you just go to their website, they'll show you lots of options for how to buy it properly if you're going to use it seriously. Now, at the moment, this level, we're just going to look at uh, some tools, toggle switches and push buttons. Later on, we might look at the clock. We're going to see our output from our uh, logic circuits using uh, a light bulb, and then we're going to have a play with some of these gates, and later on, you're going to have a play with those on your own. So, we're going to start with bringing our toggle switch onto our board here. We don't need to, if you're doing this seriously, you want to give it names and things like that, but we're not going to worry about that. We're also going to bring a light bulb onto our circuit so that we can actually see what's happening. Now, I shouldn't really use the word circuit because this is not electronics. We don't need to return any current. We don't need to have any batteries. We're just literally looking at uh, logical reactions, ons and offs, and what happens as they interact with each other. Now, my toggle switch here I can connect with uh, just by drag and drop to my light bulb here. And now if I click my toggle switch, the light bulb comes on and I click it and it goes off. So far so good. Now we're going to do something a little more complicated than that. I'm just going to select that connector there and I'm going to delete that connection. And I'm going to bring in a very simple little gate called a NOT gate here. Now NOT reverses what we give it. If we give it on, NOT turns that to off. If we give it off, as you're about to see, not turns that on. So when the switch is off, the not not off is logically on. So the switch is so the light bulb comes on. If I told the switch, the switch is on, not on is off. So that's the little not gate there. If we delete that connection and delete that connection, then I'll leave that over there. It doesn't really mind if you leave tools lying around like this on the board. Um, and we're going to introduce another little simple one, an AND gate here. Now this is going to think about what are things are. one thing is on and another thing is on. Notice we've got two inputs here, so we'll need more than just that toggle switch. So just for the sake of interest, I'm going to introduce a push button here. And I'm going to connect up my toggle switch and my push button, and then I'm going to connect the output of my AND gate to my light. Now what this is saying is if this switch is on and that switch is on, then the light bulb is on. So if I push button there, the light goes on. No, if it's not on, the light goes off. If I toggle that off, so this is always off, doesn't make any difference because off and on just means off. It's only you're only going to get an output from the AND gate of both that input and that input are on. And that's the start of doing a little bit of uh, work on Logically. Have a go yourselves with, keep playing with more toggle switches and more of these gates. You can make it as complicated as you like.